So it's Monday everyone and uh, hey TikTok fans, now uh, check it out, uh, we've done the front, check it. I'm taking the video from this side because the perp's up better, but yeah it's, uh, I've got it my whole way around, uh, 22 on the corners for his profiles and that was as high as I went there because I've run out, run out of internal, oh corners fell over. Yeah, down around here. Dean's gonna do a magic with me and turn off perps. And then two higher on there as well. But uh, on this one tomorrow, I've just got to do, finish the block work off on this while Dean's you know, loading this one up. So I'm just gonna put profiles on it now for half hour. And then uh, we'll be flying when we get on this. Nice little box. Fucking one door, one fucking patio door. A little window on that side, I think, and one internal wall. There we go, fourth profile set up. Fucking nice square fucking plot. I keep being told about these square plots, and I've actually never got on one yet. But yeah, there we go. First square plot I've got on so far. Right, see you where tomorrow. Yeah, so that was Monday. Um, sorry, San Miguel. It's fucking real not to in this weather. Got some sun. I some mad sunburn all on my shoulder from last week. Obviously I'm topping tan up wearing a stringer every day when I can. Uh, so yeah, that's a little setup there for profiles on a square plot. It's best to get them set early. Um, obviously I don't get there early, so I normally do everything at the end of the night. So with the with the Connie bricks, obviously you've got to leave them a lot of the time. If you're laying them quick, you're laying them with fresh gobble. Um, if they've got a bit of moisture in them, you're going to leave them to end of data point. So I take that hour, an hour and a half, depending on how much we've laid, and point it at the end of the day. Instead of me doing it, or speeding us up and doing it with Dean, I'll go off and do something else and um, you know set something else up. So if whether that's I set, out, set the stacks out on a gable so he can load them up. I always set the stacks out. However, I either get uh, set the profiles up like I did tonight, just saving time for where, you know, we, well, there two of us doing one job, you know. Um, Connie Bricks as well, you know, you can make money on them, you just got to go about them the right way. It's a different sort of approach, and then you can sort of attack it. And like, I can get probably more bricks down concrete than I can clay because of the fact we don't have to point them. So we're going to try a fifth, well, I think tomorrow, because that's going to be a 60 brick, 60 times 20. I think we're going to try a thousand brick. One at days, we're gonna try a thousand brick. Uh, pretty much, I think we're gonna try a thousand brick tomorrow, and not tomorrow, the day after. So we'll have a fresh down it, all loaded up, profile set, and everything. Um, yeah, I think we're gonna do a thousand brick. I wanna hit up probably just over a thousand. You know, seal it, seal it for YouTube. It can be second on YouTube to do a thousand brick in a day because I don't think. There's anyone other than call it Charlie Collison who's done it on, on camera with Labour. It's funny you say the cam, but it's a bit different than actually getting it on camera and doing it. Um, you know, so that's his goal. That's his goal this week. We're going to break a thousand, no sweat easy. Um, you know, people rag on me about my hours and whatnot, but do the hours that you can. You know, I'm doing the hours that suit my lifestyle at the moment. And, uh, you know, you do the hours you want, guys. just do what you fucking want, that's it. Right, I'll see you guys in the next clip. Right, it's ten to four, we're all fucking finished for today. Uh, I've got my best setup I have yet for a square detached plot. Check it out, uh, spent a little bit of extra time getting all ready this time. Uh, so yeah, show you what we've been doing. It's Tuesday by the way. Uh, yeah, so yeah, check it out. So that's all finished, cleaned out, stop windows. Um, and now we ain't got any more blocks on site, so I've set all this one up for brick. Every damp's on, every air brick's bedded in because they've fucking not put them in. Every tray all over is air bricks. I've got his line all set at 75. I've got profile, 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 profile. We've got line wrapped. The other door block, I couldn't find it, I've ordered another one. I've got that. 
uh, wrapping both ways and the corner walk got dory block oiled up. Um, you know, good piece of kit really. You know, it takes a little bit of getting used to, but that's all set at gauge now. I think. Anyway, I think it gauge like dory block. Check it before I go. With all in my oil, that'll just sit down here. And I've got these profiles for tomorrow. Um, just fucking lay them there. And these are just put up as expansions. Expansions, uh, two and a half brick in. And, you know, away we go there. So I've got this tray all there ready. Just every dumps on everything, so we're just fucking gonna fly. Um, Dean's gonna start that end. I'll start this end, we'll run this in a C shape. You know, repeat at the back side. It's just four, four per pot, and then boom, gable's in. Dunzo, right. I'm gonna go get a couple of door frames and go home. It's almost four. Alright, in a bit. So it's Tuesday night, a little check in once again. Um, so yeah, today we was, I was squaring around that bot work up to the top window frame. Um, basically, it was all corner building, all three hands today. Um, you know, I don't always emphasise, you know, building corners, but for any younger guys out there, even, you know, seasoned bricklayers, keep up to scratch on your freehand because sometimes it's the only option like the reason I had all the windows racked back there is because I needed to get clips in but the type of frame doesn't actually show whether there are clips in or not so you'll not probably get pulled for any of that um, on the block work if you haven't even got clips in but it depends on your type of window frame and I always put them in on the block and the brick but it has an issue which I came to on the one of the door frames where a little bit cockled, and it was pulling away from the brickwork, exposing the, like the back areas of the brick. So that'll have to be unscrewed and pulled out before I square it up. Um, when the scaffold goes up and I square it to joist, I'll have to unscrew that window frame, pull the thermobate out, you know, strain it up, and then repeat. So there is some downsides to, you know, not keeping check on your window frames and not building your block work all the way up. Up your frames first. Um, also, obviously, at the time when I built that first lift, I got around a mortar one day, and we were using below ground on the on the uh, on the block work. So I just did what I could. Um, obviously, I don't set any of my windows out on my block; it's just inaccurate, and then you end up moving your perps on your brick, and that isn't what you want to do. Um, but yeah, so today I probably earned hundred quid, hundred quid, maybe after paying Dean. And you know, some day, some days you'll be taking a bit of a loss but it's not about um, you know where you take a loss it's where you prepare to make more money on the next day so for instance we've got that square easy plot that's probably the easiest plot um, one of the easiest plots uh, that you could get it's detached which is a bonus there's more um, you know two gables and it's square, which is also a bonus, and I got four profiles on it. There's 26 long down the, sorry, it's 20, 26 long um, width, and then it's like 39 length gable. Uh, and they're, they're like ideal plots to just really get, uh, you know, get stuck into. So, like tomorrow, for instance, you know, I'll lay probably 1100 brick, maybe 1200 if I'm doing really well. Because I roll all the damps out, cut everything, I've got ties there. Um, in the morning I'll grab some extra plastic sleeves for his expansions. I'll probably grab another box of ties just so we've got it. Everything's there, There's the damps rolled out. Damp, rolling the damp out and sorting those air bricks is probably an hour's job all the way around. That's all sorted and lines are on, that's also like a 10 minute job cut all those little things out and then you set your set up for making money the next day so say I lay 1200 bricks tomorrow that's probably it probably makes 600 quid tomorrow 640 maybe um, and that's given something don't go wrong we've already got two tubs of mortar there so that's a guaranteed 800 brick so if we get a third tub dropped um, you know after dinner that'll be a guaranteed 1200 brick because you get about 400 connies out of a tub um, out of them tubs especially maybe you might get you might get 500 connies out of one of them tubs I think it worked out roughly about 400 connies um, we're going to experiment how the mortar's going because we're going to be getting through the mortar that quick on the boards 
we probably won't have any trouble with it going off um, because everything's going to be set up. You know, you, we I was working out of those blue tubs. I've got five blue tubs, five blue tubs, one black tub and one yellow tub. I've got seven tubs in total, so we can set any elevation up, back front or gable, with with tubs. You know, if the gobbo's dying on us, that's what I'd recommend. If the gobbo's dying, just shove it on tubs because ready mix dies quicker than silo gear sometimes. So, um, especially if it's a couple of days old, the retarders going in it. So. Um, but yeah, so you know what I've lost yesterday. Say day works two hundred quid a day, and I've lost. I'm like I'm half a day there. I'm half a day down. You know I'll make up with it by earning six hundred. You know tomorrow, which I'm probably fully capable of easily there, because um, Dean's going to be putting down at least probably hundred and fifty bricks tomorrow, uh, at least. Um, so yeah, you'll you'll see. I'm going to probably get some footage after dinner. So just little check ins. Uh, until dinner, and then I'll put some headcam on and get get a thousand on headcam. Uh, but I reckon we'll get at least eleven hundred down tomorrow, and then probably it'll be just me laying the gable for the last hour or so while Dean points up because he'll have probably a seven eight hundred brick to point on. Then I'll probably blast him four hundred quick on the gable because um, I think back and front six hundred I calculated what we'll get up, and then down down one of the gables I'll probably put ten twelve course on. That'll get us over a grand easy. Um, but I re I'll probably get fifteen on I reckon easily because now how we're set up and with the little trowel it's really good on fatigue. You know you're not going to get any wrist ache or anything like that. So yeah. Anyway guys, I thought I'll give you guys a little insight there. You know it does pay to get prepared. It really does pay. But obviously you know something unforeseen could happen. With ready mix you guaranteed your gobbo's there. But you know something unforeseen could happen. You know you never know. But um, yeah, I'll see you tomorrow. Hey, half past fucking eight. Half past eight. That fuck is loud. Mate. Is that how you do it, Shangy? Hey, see you in a few hours. So it's uh, twelve o'clock. Uh, I'm probably not going to record much today, other than a bit of head cam this afternoon when it's. it's it's calmed down a bit, it's a bit windy today. But yeah, this is what we've got done so far. Uh, Connie Bricks, square plot, you know, a bit of an obstacle sometimes these Connie Bricks, but check it. So, I'm up back here now, the front's up. Um, we're only going up 10 high on the front, any more than 10 and wind could catch it. Um, obviously, I'd have known we'd done block work first. Those two corners are up 20 high. Um, obviously, all insides have been flushed up. There's a few, few gaps like, but um, bonding the best. The footing in set out, you know, amazingly because we've got dining needles up front. So I'm going to probably have to do a bit of jiggery pokery over the over that front door. Um, same over here. There'll be a few clipped bricks, I reckon. About three or four clipped bricks in that. But you've got to do what you've got to do. Sometimes you've just got to piss with a prick you've been given. And in this, in this case, it's this plot. Sometimes stuff imperfect, just get over it. Uh, but yeah, we're going to bang this up now. It's 12.02. So we're doing pretty well for time. We're going to work till about half one, have a late snap. So then we'll be working well six tonight, I reckon. The plan is this back up, identical to that. And then 10 course down gable. To cement me send as a thousand brick a day brick layer on YouTube. Can you get it cemented. Right, let's carry on. Oh, yeah, I'm using tubs as well, that's my Euro setup. Fucking mint. All the tubs all the way. Little RST matches. Let's roll. First. Right, it's fucking 20 past one, and you can see how croaky I am. Skin full of beer. The kebab, and uh, yeah, it's what we got done so far. So, 20 minutes past one. That's up. Dean's point today because we're going off in this wind. It's the windiest day of year. Fucking, fucking mint, mate. Absolutely fucking mint. Got this fucking reinforcing as well. It goes in under the soldiers. Um, I'm gonna put it in maybe a course lower just so you don't forget it. Uh, so that backs up nine course. 
I'm only going to take this corner up now. I'm going to get up to find where this window is. I'll go up, check it now. Rack that corner up. Boom down again. We've already got 600 brick in there. Five hours. So, get that corner up after snap. I don't want to take that any higher. So I'm just blobbering this window with ready mix. Um, get this corner up that's covered a bit. Rack, rack this back where this window starts. Not putting any more soldiers in or out today. Fucking loud. Loud. So loud. Man. Put some oil on it. Right, get that in. So yeah, see you after snap. I know. Fucking. Fucking. Oh. Fucking lad called Changi on, on YouTube. Changi? Changi. Changi like the Changnese. Oh. Yeah. So to his, his mate, put thumbs up. He ran after him, he said, You what? He said, and he said, and he shouted to him and he went, Oh, fucking bum any man, me. <laughs> and his mate went, No, I don't want to work with you. Squared up to him, said, I don't want to bum you. <laughs> yeah, YouTube beefs, innit? Beef. They're on about a fucking charity boxing match. <sighs> How about. Yeah, for YouTube bricklayers, charity boxing match, me, Tricky Bricky. Me, Tricky Bricky, a few others, there's a lad called Tricky Bricky. He like, likes a beer like me. Good bricklayer. About having a charity boxing match. Changi, Changi won't dare come. Oh. Biggest on YouTube anyway, so as in belly wise and weight wise. So I'll just be. Don't think it'd be a fair fight no matter who fucking fought me. Ugh. Ugh. The biggest, <laughs> the biggest million on YouTube. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> sick of you bossing me around, Dean. Sick of, sick of you bossing me around. It's my. This is us. I'm sick of you bossing. Sick of you bossing me around. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. <laughs> oh, you know, fucking old house. Yeah. <laughs> when it gets older, boy. <laughs> fucking hell. And it will do by off. Oh, fuck me. This fucking gable's miles out. It's got a three quarter in again. What do you say? Just ten halves for that far side, Dean. Uh, well, not even ten. Fucking six, because we're only going twelve, aren't we? And that gets us a thousand. We're only going twelve course and we're off on. Oh. Is it backside? I'll take these bricks out tomorrow, can't I? These bricks will be soft tomorrow. It'll be still soft in the morning, won't it? For you know, for air bricks. Oh, yeah. Uh. So yeah, this is how we work out of tubs. Fucking, we're still here. Uh, about sixteen, so like that, six halves. Uh, fucking work out of tubs like this. It's not ideal, but God, I was. It's that. It's that fucking. Uh, it's that windy. Even ready mix. Nothing stands the wind. Changi would say, "Oh, NHBC man's gonna see that damp five mil too far away from Edge of Brick. Oh, quick, have a fucking 
Have I fit over it? Oh god, I'm gonna have to take my antidepressants again. Oh. Would you watch it, charity boxing match? Far in it. Hey. Yeah. Hey. Just see me get beat up. Yeah, get proper KO. <laughs> Like white collar, innit? it? It's a bit white collar. I'm already, I'm already damaged in head anyway, so I don't think it, it, if I got it, it won't make a difference. Well, no damage, is it? No. Just fucking. God, gobber was like poo. Oh, fucking tie wires, got to shove these in. <laughs> fucking hell, I forgot all my ties on that, that, last, that last cable. Oh. <sighs> Nobody knows. Tie that only the fucking ants will see with the spiders. One there. One, two, three. Yeah, one, two, three. Yeah, snappers, snap, snappies to the back, dude. Okay, put an extra one in there. One, two, three. One, two, three, yep. Yeah, that Tricky Bricky, he does like um, live streams while he's having a beer and that. Oh yeah. It's fucking funny as fuck. I always tune in when I'm having a beer just to have a, like, say hello and that. And then he plays some decent tunes to be honest, but obviously if I kept watching that I'd get hammered every night. And then I fucking won't get out done. My lifestyle's already terrible. It's absolutely devastating the way I live already. Uh, 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 fucking God, I was like fucking poo. Probably have to put some three quarters in this. Three quarters where the air bricks are. Ass. Oh, <sighs> fucking dining needle perps, mate, on this. <sighs> at least I'll be helping you point up at the end this time.
<sighs> Keep get down you cunt. Cause now it's fucking... <sighs> Chang is under me damp. Right, just start falling from there, Dean. Yeah. Uh, okay, where you go? Where you fucking go? I thought it was someone else then. What? I thought I could hear some uh, voices in my head. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Damp. And then there's fucking a. There's a tower there. Yeah, that's enough. <sighs> Some people say about this damp being cut too wide, you know, fuck me, just if you want to fucking lose sleep over that be my guest but it's just fucking damp at the end of the day it's fucking damp goes on your wall and if there's a bit more of it in the wall who fucking cares it don't make a difference that's this anxiety stuff little bits like that that put people off pretty lean. you know on youtube they fucking say oh it's got to be fucking um, it's got to be fucking you know what difference does that make a bit extra damp in wall What's it, what's it matter if you put no grooves in your spread and fucking or put grooves in your spread? What's it matter? It's about earning money for the youth of tomorrow. Earning money for your family. Fuck me, that's a bit white that. Oh, fucking. Oh, it's all over my fucking handle. It's all over my handle. Yeah. Handle. Kurt Angle. Fucking driver's got some skills. Fucking got over my fucking wall. Dropped box in. I think I thought at one point it just fucking evaporated through my line. Fucking no. Uh, start at 10 mil per, see what your lap is. What's, see what your lap's like with my brickwork below. You know, with that one on, that I've just put on. Patterson Construction and his lads have done a thousand on YouTube so I said a bit third person to do I think first first on YouTube one and one to do it with Connie's what time we on four o'clock Saw some cheap, cheap uh, timber clamps. You know them timber clamps you're looking at, Dean. You know, and BT ones. Wow. That stuff on BT Engineering. Yeah. You know, you said that were expensive. Uh -huh. Well, I found some. I found some Chinese knockoff versions. Nine quid. Yeah, that, that, they were BT. For like your profiles and that, and you're like, what's all this shit? Oh, yeah. And it was like. You know, 
are they? Yeah, tight, 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 yeah, pop, pop it tight. I'll, I'll tighten mine up as well. Yeah, dining needle tight again. See, all these engineers must be fucking gauge drunk or something. Yeah. Fucking burp, burp. Pick and dips now, good for under that tight, it don't fill your joint very well. But then you put a joint on it, it's fucking too big. At least we're all fucking up to date on all jointing, aren't we? Up to date. You alright moving? Yeah. Is it? I'll tighten it up after this course. Get a yank. I think the wind is the wind does it as well. Yeah, it's blowing it, isn't it? Here's that one's chopped. What do you say, mate? Like you scoop it up the side, yeah, that's it. Yeah. Smaller. Just a little bit, I'll clip a brick in the middle. As long as I can slide one in. Oh yeah. <sighs> Fucking then someone will leave a comment on my video going, there's no perps on that. That seen all fucking plots bonded to tight. Oh my god, it's blowing a freaking gale, isn't it? It's fucking blowing a gale. It would mate take some fucking tornado to blow that down. Well, saying that, I wish it would be on floor. I've got it on video though. Yeah, corners are strong, Dean. It like that that shape there is like the strongest you can get. Do you know what I mean? of wine my friend four o'clock on the dot Build that garage, there's fucking saying that I don't fancy pointing back of it. I think you'd want to kill yourself if we had to point a thousand bricks on the back.
careful dropping bricks down here, you'll smash your fucking handles of your bins off. It's still boiling, boiling like fuck that line, isn't it? Bigger perps this time. Yeah. Little bit, yeah. See, so look, you've done fucking eight bricks there. It's eight bricks, fucking course. Fucking flying, mate. Fucking flying. It's fucking straight. I'm flying. No, I'm not going to do it over now. I'm just going to sit down. Go on, Dean, you finish it for us, son. I'm going to be like Changi. I'm just going to film you. Come on, Sean. Sorry, mate. Come on, Sean. I'm not going to any, uh, I'm not know to rip anyone off by fucking working. Ah, oh, it's fucking in the three quarter in middle. Ah. Fucking old Dean. It's my fault. Fucking hell, opening them thinking that I'd lose the room. Yeah. Can we get a clipper in it? Yeah, we get a bill, we get a fucking really cropper. Fucking what fucking trial trial boy, come on. Ugh. Hey, line up. <laughs> Fucking Philip College taught me. 
shoulders, fucking this, fucking dodding it on like that. Oh my god! Your bed massive. Fucking hell. Fucking right. I know, it's like diddling about, isn't it? Diddling. No, it does feel like it's fucking dang. Yeah, it's, it's not. No. It's definitely not, but there is a lot of ambient ambient wind, isn't there? Ambient wind. Ambient windage. I want to try one of these fucking. They like fucking do that with a fucking gobble up the side of the tub. And he rolls it up the fucking tub, this fucking Belgian lad. And he uses a fucking fold out foot fold out roller to measure shit with. That inspector gadget. Oh, fucking hell. How's yours looking? Is it half bond? Yeah. Sound, mine is as well. Me, bet you're fucking glad to let some bricks, bricks fucking late finally. Did it, yeah. did it wind you up having to join up after a lot of time? Yeah. Uh, what? Not really, no. I say I fucking used to hate it. Me, I don't like jointing. Did a school once, so we had to join it with his glove. That was the best job ever. <laughs> Rub your glove on it. Not even like. Just rub your glove on it. Ugh, ah, see if that fits, Dean. Fucking beautiful. Sound that, mate. Fucking not wrong with them, is there? Not wrong with them. Fucking tire wires. Shit. So easy like a glass of wine, my friend. Just one every three up, up your uh, up your expansion, dude. Yeah, I'll leave you three there. One, two, three. 
Uh, I think it's a max of brick back you can go for your reveals. I used to do it half a brick, but yeah. <laughs> that's all we used to do is king span. We used to put his we used to put his ties right up to his window frames. Yeah. And then you just shove your king span. It don't you know it don't bust through it. Yeah, no. oh. Just take this light, just take this off. Dale's gone. Even the Dale has gone. See you tomorrow, John. Fucking hell. Puh. Days it's there on Wednesday, aren't we? Yeah. Oh fuck me, we've got another three days at work. Full well, load fucking I suppose. I just come in and load some out. <laughs> fucking sped us up today, ain't it? Loading all that out. Yeah. Well fucking come in Saturday and just load up. Trying to hook it onto the corner, you know, so brick might not fucking diddle as much. Yeah. Don't know why it's fucking like you say. It is like it's slack, isn't it? Yeah. Mm. Get another tight and hold on. <sighs> Sorry, Dean. Hold on. How's that? A bit better. Thirty nine, a calculator, less five. Thirty four, of course, so thirty four times ten is three hundred and forty. So we've got to do like thirteen course. That gets us four hundred. And I calculated 600, but then I built that. That's that's four, seven, cut it seven times, 1070, 670 plus 400, 1070. And let's say you've done at least, let's say you've done at least 100 bricks. So yeah, 12 or 13 course and fucking we've done it easy. Well, I've got to keep it real with YouTube. Obviously, so you're fucking laying them as well, so. So much time. 
Oh my fucking head's killing. Okay. <coughs> 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 yeah, it's fucking working, isn't it? You know, when you fucking. I might have. Off Mel. We might have developed it. We might have just developed it. Yeah. Oh, I wish your sight was like this all day. Huh? Felt like I couldn't even hear today, could you? you I couldn't, felt like I couldn't even hear. <sighs> Fuck's off. You fucking, what you fucking, what's up with you, mate? Fucking, I'll knock you out. My name's Changi. Fucking, I'll run over to you because you've mocked me. It's my job, all right? It's fucking my job, this. And I want everything perfect for when inspector comes. I want it fucking amazing. And I'm going to get here before everyone. Oh. And then I'm going to go home and not have a beer. I'm going to go home and have a beer. <laughs> I'll have to edit all of this. I said I wasn't going to rip him, rip him to bits, but then after he ripped me, ripped me to bits, I thought, fuck it. And I, thought, I think it's men's every time Tricky fucking wants to, threatens to knock his face in. Because on YouTube, I, I've got the, the nicey nicey come across rate. You know, big, I like come across like camp on YouTube. Yeah. But I'm actually a fucking raving lunatic, just no one knows about it. I'm just raving fucking. I'm a raving. <laughs> raving mincer. <laughs> fucking hell. I'm just like one of them great hard mincers though. Don't come any man. They don't want to know me. <laughs> don't want to know me, I'm telling you. <laughs> That's what it is like on YouTube though, like. Don't fucking, they all like. Hardest fucking men on hardest men on the world, and we all fucking lay bricks. <laughs> Any man. <sighs> this uh, this Harry vegan. <laughs> oh. What the fuck he do ya? What the fuck he do? Shall I do him? I'll do him. Oh my god, I'm gonna have to pick up a thousand F clamps. What? I'm gonna have to go and fucking search for these thousand F clamps I've got laying around sight. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Because what profiles we've had on. Fucking. There's a thousand fucking. I've laid a thousand bricks, but then I, I spent a day finding all my F clamps. Oh, it won't go back in now. Oh. Can't get my fucking. my brick tie back in. Oh. Fuck me, if someone gets a fucking razor blade down that. Oh. Oh, probably caved me all in. There we go. Uh. <laughs> oh, fucking black out against this fucking ruler down there. I'm fucking be fucked. What's up?
Oh my god, we're gonna have to load these back up, aren't we? These fucking tubs. <laughs> these tubs are alright for fucking <laughs> until they're empty, then you gotta throw them away. <laughs> and get boards out. <laughs> I think they're meant to put ties in now. Oh, next course. You were just putting joint on front of them, like 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 me. Yeah. Yeah, it seems the best way to lay these. Yeah. Like yeah. It's easier, isn't it? Yeah. A lot quicker. <sighs> I fucking feel like I forgot some of Definitely not in this gable. No windows are fuck all in this one. So that's Dale's gable, isn't it? Yeah. He's had no in. The Dale. You all right, lads. You all right, mate. I'm it. I think his name's Mohammed. No, it is. He's actually Mohammed. No, but it's the most common name on earth, isn't it? According to McLovin. It was either between that or Muhammad. It's like, who the fuck is named Muhammad? Who the fuck are you, seal? Could it be? So you're the only Vanit car park in it? Yeah, well, you're fucking vehicle in car park. So is, is that yours? Where was that coming from then? Fuck me. Fucking, I'll ch I'll go check your van mate, because if they nick all them rotten gloves that are in your fucking back of your van. Wow, no, fucking, fucking, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna jack up and go off. <laughs> I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go and jack. I'm gonna jack up and go back to making kebabs. <laughs> Could I do one over fifteen? Making them gyros. <laughs> them gyros. I'll just go back to getting my gyro. Oh, fuck I'm gonna fucking sell me house. I'm gonna sell me house. <laughs> I'm gonna sell me house, right? And then I'm going to claim I'm on Dole, and then I'm going to get them to give me a council house and buy it off, buy it off government for thirty grand, and then put for, then put forty, and then put hundred grand into it. Well, anyway, you won't have enough money back. <laughs> they don't give you, I'm going to send all my monies to like an offshore account. I'm going to send all the money, <laughs> all my, all my monies. <laughs> That's what like a favourite phone jacket where he's like, oh the monies, <laughs> you haven't got to wire you the monies. Cash monies, uh, I'm send all my cash monies. <laughs> I'm going to sell my house and buy it and then get a council house. <laughs> I'm going to go to South Yorkshire Police and ask them if they've got any ex-fucking crack houses that I can buy off them oh, for cheap. Plenty, don't I can, can I buy some ex-house, some, some ex-council houses that have had droves in them? For very cheap. For very cheap price. Even if it's not bothered if it's burnt down. <laughs> yeah. And then I'll just repoint the brickwork. <laughs> <laughs> oh fuck me. Oh fuck me, who's ringing me now? Be someone telling me I've got COVID. Oh, I've 
I've got Coco. Oh, fucking Ty's X course. Yeah. I'll put them away. I best go answer it. Fucking. Mel might be having a fucking seizure. I don't wanna fucking hate you. Bill gives you a lot of potatoes. I fucking hate it when I have, have raw footage when I'm on my head cam because I have to go through and watch about an hour's worth of me brick lane to see if, make sure I don't say out fucking to get me banned off YouTube. Like, just not nasty words, isn't it? Not nasty words. Oh, Chang is gay. So on the windiest day of the year, we've silenced the critics and hit PB on the conies. Tight joints as well, so a little bit diff more difficult to lay. Ready mix, th two day old ready mix. Now uh, this, this needs brushing, it's just been jointed. Uh, but yeah, using tubs most of the day, we use boards to start with and tubs. This grand total, believe it or not, is a big PB for me, it's a PB for Dean, PB for me. Dean's laid about 125 bricks today at least, if not a few more. But in total, we've laid 1175 there. Uh, so, and fucking folks that have a magic to those blocks that have just arrived today in the fucking block. So, we'll complete that in the morning, smash this gable in. This is where all the little windows are and the fucking meter boxes and shit, so. We won't do a thousand, we don't think tomorrow, but we're not going to work as late, it's fucking 6.01, so yeah. So, you know, it just shows that if you sell ride, you know, one and one, or one and improver, all the that, but as well, he's done really fucking well to load all this out in about, loaded about 2,400 brick out in about three and a half hours. Connie's as well, Conkers. Call me Conker McGregor. There we go, that's what 11 bricks and 1200 bricks looks like in a nutshell. Look at them soldiers, the best ones I think I've done all year. But yeah, fucking mint these, fucking Gleason houses. You know, nice fucking style, living in these houses. Fucking, uh, I always say this, but you know, fucking, if you get on with gaffers, and you've relaxed and fucking everyone has a laugh. You fucking just turn out more quality work. Whereas if you go on a job and you just fucking gaffer don't like you or fucking summit it right or you've bad vibes, you don't want to get as much done. So fucking, you know, find someone you size what you like fucking working. That's the one we did. So, middle of the second week now. Big window that. 1770 window. But yeah, alright. So everyone, cheers. That was a good day, a very good day in fact. I'm having a celebrating, I'm pretty much celebrating because, you know, um, someone like myself, a bit laid back, chilled out. I don't ever attack work that hard. You know, I'm not, I ain't got, a, I ain't got that, that, that greedy bones in my body that fucking attacks work and is driven by pure money. I just don't have it in me, but, I took some advice from some fucking very knowledgeable mentors out there and some old older guys who know what they're talking about. Put them into practice. Four pro, six profiles, some fucking pick and dip, some lines, tubs, stands, the fucking combination with it. Some we've just smashed through some work, and I said I'd do it. I said I'd do it, and I did it with a fucking skin full of beer. You know, I'm 112 kilo. You know. I'm 27 in like three, four days. You know, you know a lot of younger, a lot of time you just gotta. Yeah, you know, I'm not one who's fucking a greedy bastard, really. I'm not. I've just sort of made the YouTube channel showing guys what you can do with a fucking seven-inch fucking ten-pound trowel from SB Tool, ten-pound eBay trowel. You know, a few section, you know, six or so. You know, sections of aluminium, fucking F clamps, fucking basic tools. You know, I ain't, I'm not a millionaire. 
I've not I fucking I ain't got fuck on really. But you know, putting some good methods into practice. I've got brother in law, Dean, he's doing phenomenal. He's fucking best labourer I've ever had. You know, well your labourer makes you your money. You know, look at what I'm turning out at the end of the day, it's fucking you know you know, I pay him fucking top money. Um someone of his experience. I don't fucking I don't have this boss complex, I don't have fuck all, I just I'm an hard working young lad who, you know, he pays people what they deserve and you know, you t when you're turning out after paying a labourer seven hundred quid in a, in a day, you know, I got a fucking got a C in my my maths and fucking I don't even think I had a C in English, I just bugged it. You know what I mean? I've got no qualifications um, you know, to really speak of. But put some graft in. Do a few years of Brick Lane College, get an apprenticeship, you know, put some graft in. I used to get, you know, a bus and a train to site before I had me, I took me seven attempts of my driving test. You know, I've fucking done it all. I've fucking attacked, attacked the building trade, the Brick Lane world. The last 11 years of my life and this is what you can do. You don't have to be some fucking know-it-all, do good in, you know, fucking Chang Chong, Changi. You know, you don't have to be like that. You can fucking, you know, can fucking have a go and do it. You know, you don't have to know it all. You don't have to be a fucking stickler. You know me, but you can learn to do it neatly, quickly, efficiently. You can be in, you know, just go for it. And you can fucking do it. Lads, few lads have messaged me. Is Brick Lane worth doing? You know, if you want your own house, fucking, you know, what, fucking the, the English dream, not the American dream, but the English dream, your own house at 20 odd. Fucking, you know, pay your bills on time. Fucking, don't have a beer on the night. Fucking, oh, my arm's aching, but just fucking, you know, brick laying is something that you can make a life for your son without being a brain box, without having all the answers, you know, without doing, having all the uni debt, you know, go to college, it's fucking for free until you're 21, I think. You know, you put some effort in and you'll get it, you know, you'll fucking, you know. Anyway, I'm just showing what's possible because people out there fucking like, you know, a lot of the YouTube channels, I'm sorry for saying this, but a lot of guys are in the fucking late 30s, 40, and they're fucking coming out here telling us what, telling, you know, lads of my age, 26, 27, how to do it when you can fucking get out there and have a fucking good go. And still fucking, you know, you, you can put, you know, you can put some people to shame. There's Charlie out there, he's, he's probably young, he's the youngest out there. You know, he's he obviously a bit older than I am, but he's fucking, he's fucking turned the Brick Lane world upside down with some of the stuff he's doing. He takes it to a different level I do. But, you know, he's showing what's possible. And then I'm fucking, I've had a, I've re replicated, you know, by taking notes off, you know, some knowledgeable old geezers out there. And I've fucking, you know, I've, I've replicated it in a sense, you know, I mean, I'm not fucking out special, you know, I just do it and fucking you guys can as well, easily, fucking, probably piss all over me, because I fucking drink Stella on a night and have kebabs, if you're fucking having protein shakes, fucking chicken and rice, boxed up meals, fucking doing the whole fucking nine yards, you'll piss all over these numbers, but, you know, we're going to keep going, we're going to keep pushing it. I'm going to get a bit more fucking regimental with my attitude, but, you know, I'm how I am. I'm how I am. I can't, I'm, I like an enjoyable, chill work environment. So what? I'm fucking shoveling, gobbling to boards now and again. Fuck it. You know, I like it. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. I just thought I'd put it out there because, you know, you ain't got to be a fucking arsehole to earn loads of money. You just ain't got to be, you ain't got to be an arsehole. You can fucking have a good go. Be one of lads and fucking smash some bricks in and you can make some money. You ain't got to be a cunt can be cool as fuck and have a beer and fucking be a proper fucking man yeah see you in the next video